Hi everyone, today I will show you how to crochet these beautiful hand sanitizers and alcohol gel bottles. This one can hold this on up. Then put this to there into that this cover or then we just like this then you can put all these like key rings can hang on your handbags or something else then easy you can see or easy for you can use it everyday use every time when you need it because now we everywhere we go we need to be safe is what happened around the world now is COVID-19 all right then what or materials what I use in these projects like you can see here buttons key rings like this and these yarns I use 100% cotton yarn is for pie yarns this one and I use 2.5 millimeter hook and then you will need marker a little one here for sewing on these buttons needles and little bit here and scissor cut your yarn and more a little bit here is paper and pencil for to mark how many rolls you've been you had to crochet and you not forget it and this one just simple and easy to remember if you need it all right we got everything now then let's get started first make slip notch and that what I do this way put the hook to then yarn over and make the notch then start with make 30 chains 30 of the chains 2 3 4 5 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. So, enjoy the yarns, the ends. Or this when we start here make slip stitch like this and chain one and if you think you will forget where you start put marker on the first chain we make and we can know which one we start then next chain next stitch I take only one take this over as well then we can hiding away here this first one here on this what stitch I will make Put your hook on over on top of the yarn and pull over, then yarn over. Same again, same single crochet, but we go on top, don't go under here. So, on top. Pull over, 
next one on top and pull over next one on top and pull over on top and pull over Just do like this until the ends of the rows see easy if we go on top we can see like um, cross stitch look like X and you right I will see you the ends of these rows then I come to my last one here last stitch you can see where I mark on the first chain we make here, we just make slip stitch into there to join this row together this way, like this, pull two. So total we make whatever chains you start with we end up with same stitch what we make so I make 30 of the chains when I start so I make this row I will make single crochet all the way around 30 stitch as well okay and then I mark down um, one row I made then next row is same chain one next stitch this one here not this one next one here we make counting one so mark chain one what we start here again then you know where to join the stitch when finish the rows so this row is same to carry on single crochet all the way around go on top this way like this on like this and you can see, see on my hair like I say like a cross stitch the X if I will show you if you're going down this way you see if it's not make the X or cross stitch like I explained you on this one see this difference you can see it it's up to you if you like to make cross stitch pattern like mine you can follow mine if you just want to make single crochet normal single crochet just carry on as you would like it to be so we make 30 stitch around so we make 26 rows all the same over and over until got 26 row then uh, I will meet you guys there when I got my 26 rows okay and now I got my 26 rows totals and next one I will start to decrease on the next row. Same again before we start the next row. Chain one. Chain one. And next stitch. one 
two, three, four. We make four single crochets and next one I will decrease. So one we got one roof in here and next one same again don't release there so decrease so we make one stitch from two stitches and next one four single crochet again one two three and four and next one de decrease so one make two stitch together one next one so we got two stitch together now then pull your yarn over like this and next one and four single crochet one two three four and decrease next stitch so two stitch two and over same again one two three four and decrease one last one here one two three four and decrease one leave in there and next one and pull together like this and joys from the first chain we start normal same here slip stitch like this and then total on this row we decrease is we got 25 stitches together and next row chain one This one we start three single crochet and decrease one, two, three and decrease one. Don't pull yet, leave it there. Then next one, this and pull over same time. Next one, three single crochets like this and decrease, leave in there. So we got two loops, pull over, same time. So next stitch, make three two and three decrease one two and pull over same time one two three and decrease one two three and 
three, one, three single, two, three, and decrease one, two, same time. And join on first chain, we start here, slip stitch, this. So on these rows, make total 20 stitch all rounds. And next one, just carry on single crochet all the way around. So make 20 stitches, uh, 20 single crochets all the way around. We make total four rows of single crochet to carry on same four rows I mean 20 stitch per rows on this time one two three to carry on like this all the way around I will meet you when we got total four rows together when I got my four rows on top here or whatever you will need it want to be high on the top of this bottom here top here if you got the bottles with you you can just slightly put into this cover this if you happy with how far you want it to be you can make two or three you need to make four like mice or if you want to make because it depends how tight when you crochet if you make really loose maybe uh, you can make only two rows on the top here to cover up middles to the top here it depends on how you crochet as well all right we just finish on this side now so cut your yarn then just whipping your yarn to hide the end, hiding the end of this yarn like this. So we finish on this here. So we start on lit cover up this side here. Right. This one I start with 30 chain stitches and then I will divide half of to make a lid. So this one I start from this size. You can see stitch here. This one be first stitch. So counting to to 15 so I start 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 so at the end here so I start from here end of here so to divide on your how many chains you start just divide half of your cover and then start from here I just make this put a yarn over this way and chain one and start first one here so same again counting one two three four five six seven eight nine ten 11, 12, 
12 13 14 15 this way like this just half and have to make this 13 for I made 15 of this one the mean halfway of mine so to make this 15 row or 15 stitch of make five rows of them so once I make one so chain one turn over and first stitch here should make single crochet into that like this one two three four five six to carry on right this one we make 15 stitches for 14 or uh, for four oops, for fifth oops, sorry for five rows of this one all right i will meet you there when i got fifth rows five rows on this 15 stitch yes so one two three four five so next row i will start to decrease chain once and turn your work and on first then on first here decrease one two and pull over and just carry on on single crochet two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven then we got two stitch left here so decrease decrease one and two pull over chain one turn your works this row we i gonna start to decrease again on the edge on the end of the rows both sides same so one two like this and just carry on single crochets all the way round to the end and left to stitch to make decrease all right i come to the end of my nails after we got nine single crochets and decrease the end of this row one two and put together and next one chain ones and turn your works and decrease same again one and two pull together so we make seven single crochet one two three four five 
सिक्स सेवन एंड डिक्रीज वन टू दिस चेन वन एंड चेन यू वर्क ओवर ऑन दिस वन इफ यू चेन यू लिट लिट डाउन लाइक दिस इफ यू हैप्पी विद इट you just finish all this size when you finish i would like to say finish on on the right side up this way so put this bottle try it on there then cover up if you happy with it on here you just finish on this the last one i will show you So last this row finish so decrease same one two and decrease sorry same again decrease one and two decrease and one Two, three. Oh, sorry. I made two, and chain three. How big of your buttons? You can go around with it, so you can make one, two, three, or four, and one, two, three. Sorry, I will make this size. So start from decrease. We got decrease here. Then single crochet and one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. We make one single crochet like this. And decrease. Got two decrease here. Got two stitch and decrease like this. And then you can finish on this one if you're happy with it. Like this. <coughs> Show on this one. See. Put your mark. Mark up your where you want to put your buttons. Put it down. Which ones you would like it to be? Which way? So mark mark it down on this one on my. Gonna be half. See, because we make half face, so counting half one. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, so got fifteen. Start from seven here, middle here, and there, and then I can make my buttons. Oh, here, this way, right? Then fasten your yarns if you're happy with it, or you can leave it there until you sew, sewing your button down. And make sure it's got the right position for you to hold on these buttons, All right? Start. You can use the yarn from uh, what you crochet. You can split your yarns. Whatever. How can make it to be small size like this? Then just sew sewing your buttons into there. All right. After I sewing all these buttons of my ears, then I try on on as well if this make big enough for buttons. 
if that not big enough, if you got big buttons bigger than mice, you can make a chain bigger as well. So this one we make one, two, three, four, four chains. You can add more five or six. What well, depends on how big or this buttons. Alright, and when I happy with it, I come back on this one and we end up with decrease and can fasten the yarns to this one, the last stitch that on previous rows to make slip stitch to then cut the yarn and whipping the end of the yarns. That's it. Finish on this part here. Yes. And next one, I will show you how to make the key rings holders to hold the key rings here. We need to be um, to use these I wouldn't to use a crochet. If you like to crochet, you can crochet it. And then the last one here is make little rings for key ring to go on. I would say we we make middles. We make 15 stitches for 5 rows here. Yes? So we can make middle of it. So 1, 2, 3, 4. I will start on middle here. Yes? Or you can try on your bottles. Put it in. So which the middles of your bottles you want it to be holder on the middle seams when keyring go on just mark it out then just do it make sure it's uh, in the middle part of the lid cover here so it's mine so I counting 15 so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 so 15, so we make, I start from here. So you can go down here. 7 and this one. Leave it down here. And and cross, leave one here and there, and go back in there. Like this, to leave a little bit on here for key rings to go on. How big you want it to be? Like this. So go back same holes again. Okay. Don't make it too tight. Whatever you want it to be. I don't want it to be that big. I just make a little bit here. So this one. Go back. Same. So make two loop. It's same length. And then go back up here. This way, pull, you can see the end here, and then from your size, invert to your size, pull the yarn, pull, pull needles into that loop, two loop there. Then big loop here, make 
needle go through then pull it this way same again start from your size and and see that there go from outside to inside to you toward you this one like this same to carry on same this way pull it and you can see make the ring here don't pull let's say needle go back toward to you mix like this you can see just carry on until you cover up that two yarn two loop that you make and then finish then just fasten your yarn then that's it put key ring on that make it close together okay this one might I come to the end now so go back to back part of here back so that this one we leave on that start to tie it together this one <coughs> sorry like this and I whipping my yarn both ends together and heading away this one and cut the yarn like this that's it I This size of my as well, and put key rings into there. This one, I got mine in there. That is, that's it. So, got my bottles and sanitizers gels and car gels to be whole in place like this that's it all done i hope you enjoy to make these with me as i do that's it i love it beautiful pattern as well or them like look like cross stitch thank you for watching my videos please don't forget to subscribe my channels all the details or this yarn or how you can follow me on facebook or instagram and i leave all the details below the subscribe box I will see you next videos. Thank you for watching. Bye.